good morning dear students today we are going to study about the transformation of energy now you have studied energy law of conservation of energy you have studied now you are going to study about the transformation of energy how the energy transforms transfers okay that you are going to study now in the law you have studied that you cannot create the energy you cannot destroy the energy then only what to happens it just transfer from one form to the another form this you have studied okay so that changing of energy here you are going to study the topic today's topic is transformation of energy that is what energy one form of energy transfers into the another form of energy okay and this phenomena is called as uh, transformation of energy okay means it is not created or it cannot be stored it is just from one it is changing okay so few examples are there see here green plant prepare their own food our daily life example it is you can see the plants prepare their own food have you ever think how it prepares what are the transformation of energy in the green plants okay so what are the transformation as you know green plants have their uh, chlorophyll they have what is this this is chemical means this is the chemical energy stored in the plants okay and they are using what they are using the solar energy sunlight they are using so they are using solar energy they have chemical energy means using this they are converting uh, it into the food by the process of photosynthesis you know they prepare their food so here energies are there okay so here is also con uh, solar energy is converted into another form of energy to get their food means here what happens transformation takes place of energies second example is ball thrown okay a ball is thrown yesterday only we have considered the derivation of law of conservation of energy in that i we have studied that from a height if the ball is thrown down what happens potential energy gets kinetic uh, converted into the kinetic energy so same here for uh, now here what we are doing we are taking a ball we are throwing it upward okay with the hand we are throwing means which energy we have applied over here we have applied the muscular energy to throw the ball and it is converted into kinetic energy as the ball is moving means it is moving it has a kinetic energy okay such transformation this is very interesting topic uh day to day life also you can see many examples you can see around you for lifting a book what you are doing for uh, different things now here are some few examples i have given you daily life examples cycling okay cycling for cycling this too you will solve and you will send me for cycling what what are the energy transformations okay for cycling what are you are doing you are sitting on a cycling you are pedaling with your uh, uh, legs okay means which type of energy is used over there then when you are pedaling the uh, cycle what happened the cycle moves okay so which type of energy means you have to write the transformation of energy uh, this is very important questions can come in exam also that write the transformation of energy uh, when you are uh, um, cycling okay when you are cycling or a question may also can, can come that uh, write the transformation of energy what is the transformation of energy when you are firing a crackers crackers you all uh, all know what it is so what happens when you light a cracker okay cracker already has a chemical energy into it and you are putting a uh, heat energy to that okay you are putting fire to the cracker that time what happens you can see colorful lights light energy you can hear the sound sound energy is there again what what things are there yes you will write this tell me the transformation of this to is your homework as well as this is also your homework one example i have given you similarly you will solve this see this first i have uh, it is electric motor now everyone knows what is electric motor electric motor works on electricity so here electrical energy is used and when you give the electric supply to the motor what happens it start mechanically working so here for electric motor electrical energy is converted into mechanical energy one i have solved for you remaining you will solve and you will send me see here second electric generator okay here you know you you think on that very interesting points are this you can see electric generator for electric generator what you have to give and what you are getting back think on that steam engine steam engine everyone knows for preparation of steam what you have to give and after prepare after giving this uh, that energy what happens to the engine okay think on that electric bulb very simple then dry cell also and solar cell solar cell you know it works on sun so which type of energy it is using and which type what type of energy is giving just write down and you will send to me thank you